Hey, what's up guys? Ken here from the Retro Toyscopates channel. I'm at a toy store and I'm checking out what appears to be an Imaginex Jurassic World Ankylosaurus. I mean, the sign says it's supposed to be an Ankylosaurus, but on first glance, I thought that I was looking at something from Beyblade. Like the back section of this thing is supposed to be a round firing launcher that shoots discs of some kind. Uh, okay, there you go. Now you get to see where the dinosaur begins and ends. There's a head and there's a tail. So this circular thing on its back is supposed to be the creature's body. But why did they make the decision to make it look like a dining table? This looks like one of those dining tables that you find in restaurants that spin around so that you can get all the dishes that are on the other end of where you are seated. What do you guys think? Right. Uh, so the action feature here has you turning the knob on the creature's back to get the tail swinging about. Let's see how that works. Okay, this thing also comes with a uh, packing figure. And uh, this guy also has some accessories as well. That's not too bad. I can't really make out what this thing is supposed to be though. Okay. Back of the box and you see a picture of the creature using its tail to straight up pummel another human character. That's right. And uh, at the same time, the Ankylosaurus is also being operated by another human, the human that comes with the toy. Now, I'm just curious, why would humans attack other humans in this show unless i don't know the guy that's being bashed about with the tail is a bad guy but this guy is definitely dead by the way you know there's no universe where you can get bashed about by a dinosaur tail and still live so yeah it's pretty violent imagery anyway that's the figure i think the ankylosauruses are pretty cool characters in the movie and they always seem to be on the side of the human characters. But this one kind of seems like a missed opportunity by Imaginex. I mean, they didn't have to use such a perfectly defined circle for the creature's body. It just looks unnatural compared to the other dinosaurs they've done. Also, why the hell is this thing blue? Okay, anyway, let me know what you think of this. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks, guys. I'll catch you all again real soon.